Gloucester, Massachusetts. Sailors have been making port here since the 1600s, and thousands of them have been lost at sea over the centuries. Before pleasure boating came along, going to sea meant risking your life in wooden sailing ships, most notably the schooner fleet that harvested a bountiful catch of countless varieties of fish. The schooners still sail out of Gloucester, but now they carry tourists instead of fish. Today we're here in Gloucester with Captain Tom Ellis of the Thomas Landon. So Tom, how long has the uh, schooner fleet been in operation? Like everything, schooners evolved from um, something that came before them. And it was in 1713, um, right over in that cove over there, Smith's Cove, there was a Mr. Robinson who was launching sort of the next evolution of these fishing boats. And the way they launched the boats was on their side. They'd lean them over a little bit and there was a wedge so that by the time the boat hit the um, water, they were right on their side. They called them side launches. And uh, when that thing slid into Smith's Cove, this old woman said, oh, look how she scoons. And that was the word that they used for skipping rocks over waters. Really? So Mr. Robinson said, then we'll call her a schooner. You know, you talk about boat safety and safety on the water. Well, 10,000 men died from this town fishing. And um, you can imagine that, that the people who survived that were most interested in supporting anything that made boating more safe. Well, uh, we'll be sure to spread the word and send me your way, Tom. Appreciate it. All right. Thanks Thanks. for your time, Tom. Good luck, you guys. Thank All you. Right. Hope you learn everything there is to know. Absolutely. Thank you. <laughs>